What's up YouTube and welcome to this video. So the video is about hosting your .NET application locally which can help reduce system load and if you want to test your application without opening the Visual Studio you can also do that and it can also help you test how the app will work out on the production server. So let us begin. The first thing we need is go to add or remove program search for iis express this comes pre-installed with windows 10 but if if you don't find it here then you can download and install from here now go to program and features turn off windows feature and search for internet information services and check all of these click OK now search for IIS and you can see that we have the inter internet information services Now we have to make our application and publish it. So I'm gonna create a new project. And for my first example, I will choose the ASP.NET web application for the .NET framework. And I am choosing the MVC template. However, it does not matter that whatever template you want to choose. So go to build, publish and publish to folder, browse wherever you want to store the files. So D, make a new folder, publish slash mvc app finish click this edit button and check the delete all existing files so you won't have to delete the files when publishing again So the publish was successful. Now let's try to open the IIS Express. So expand this sites. Add an application to the default website. So the path is D publish MVC app. MVC click OK so here is our hosted app click this browse to check it out so you can see that our ASP.NET app is now hosted on the local host now it's not necessary uh, for the IIS manager to remain open you can close it you can see that it's closed but I can still access my application so now let us look at our second example so let us move on to our second example and this time I will create a ASP.NET Core web API application so this one let us choose the .NET 5 so let me create a new controller
Now let us publish this. Core app. Publish. So our app is successfully published. Now let us host it on the IIS. So core. And let us check this. So it's giving us this error. This is because we have to install the hosting bundle for our .NET applic .NET Core or .NET 5.6 application. So .NET 5.0 hosting bundle. We need to install this hosting bundle and if this problem still persists then restart your PC. If the problem is still there then install this x64 installation. So we will install only the hosting bundle and we hope that it solves our problem. Agree install. Now let us try again. So now our app is working. Hello. So it shows the hello world. After the installation you are still getting the uh, you are still getting the error. Then you can try changing the pool. Click here add application pool. Choose the no managed code and switch the code using advanced settings and here choose the pool one. Click OK and browse. So the app is working. Sometime when you are running too much application, your application stops working. So you need to create new pools and move your application to the new pools. So this is all for the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up and do subscribe to the channel. See you next time.